speaking with Aaliyah shortly after her grandmother passed away. We talked about how much she loved her and how much she missed her grandmother. And as I listened to Aaliyah, I was very touched by her sincerity, by her strength, and her love. In this time of our loss, I draw upon her example of faith that one day we will be together again. Aaliyah once wrote these words about her grandmother. Like the sun, you gave us sustenance and warmth. Like the moon, you will remain a light that will continue to shine down upon us. We feel the same about Aaliyah, and we will always love you. There have been thousands upon thousands of letters written by fans all over the world about Aaliyah, how she touched their lives. And I'd like to read one now. Aaliyah gave more to us in her 22 years than most will ever contribute in a lifetime. It's one thing to recognize your gift, but it's an extraordinary blessing to share your talent with the world. Aaliyah gave so much to so many, and for one, I will not be sad or mourn her death, but celebrate her life and be thankful for the gifts that's touched so many. We haven't lost anyone. We've only gained an angel. That is so true. That was from Kay from Georgia. Well, my favorite song on the album, it's hard to pick because I love them all, but if I had to pick one right now, I would say I care for you because that song is it's just gorgeous to me. It's five years old. Tim and Missy did that song right when I finished One in a Million, and I really wanted to put it on that album, but the album's already mastered, and there was no way I could put it on. So we put it aside and waited, and it doesn't sound like it's five years old at all. It's just classic, it's timeless, and I like what the song is saying. It's a female, you know, being the strong person in a relationship, you know, saying to a guy, you know, if you're upset, let me wipe your tears, let me care for you, let me prove to you that I can love you, and I just really like that. I thought it was different.